Hello, we are the Three Way Beauties, and this is Dr. Kathleen Morris. Denise Foy. Welcome to lesson number six. Ooh, lesson six, the Glamour Week. We have something quite fascinating in store for you. <laughs> I am excited. And I am <laughs> extremely nervous. <laughs> I say, let's do it. Yeah, so stay tuned to find out what it is we're getting ourselves into this week. How was your week this week, Kathleen? I'm going to have to say I had an excellent week. An excellent week. <laughs> now, in general, I thought the week went pretty well for me. Um, I felt really good about diet in most regards. I did notice that with the cooler weather, I tend toward hot tea and soup, so my liquid intake is there, but my sodium intake is up. I splurged one day, but we can all survive one day of a splurge in terms of diet. Uh, exercise was great for me. I actually like cooler, crisper weather, so I took my exercise um, to heart and outside, and I think that yes, it was excellent for my complexion. Yeah, that's Which, very good. There you go. Yeah. So I, I, I feel good about my week. Oh, good. You? I feel mediocre about my week. So I got on the scale as I do once a week, every week, and I gained half of a pound. And I was very frustrated by that because I'd been so diligent with and my doing so diet. Well. But I wasn't overly diligent with my exercises per usual. It seems to be <laughs> <laughs> but a project. I think what I read is that we really only have to do the exercises four days a week, three or four days a week. So that I did do. And then he says that other days where you're trying to um, work on certain areas, then just do the exercises for those areas. Mm -hmm. So I did an analysis and I marked down where I'm supposed to be from like a inches perspective on all of the different parts of my body. And there's really only three areas that I need to work on. I guess I'm frustrated with the gaining of the half of a pound, but mm -hmm. it's not the end of the world. <laughs> This week will probably be better. And did I hear that you're training for Wimbledon? <laughs> <laughs> well, I've been playing tennis for 30 years. I should probably be in some <laughs> sort of circuit at the moment. But I did play for two hours last night. And I had on a sports bra that I always wear. And I just remember looking down and being like, where did these boobs come from? They came from Joseph Spider's through Way to Beauty, they did. Oh my gosh. <laughs> And this week, we gave you a little bit of a teaser. Um, there was something that Joseph Weider mentions in the Glamour Touches portion of this week. And I'll include these um, screenshots for you at the end of the video. But it says, for a pretty party complexion, try this home facial. Oh boy. After cleansing face, pat on white of egg all over your face and neck. Let it dry and remain on for 15 minutes. Rinse off with warm water and finish with splashes of cold. So, our luxurious <laughs> throughway beauty of yours, Dr. Kathleen, has agreed to... Agreed? I jumped all over the opportunity. And I was like, ooh. No, I'm doing More it. power to you. Do it. So we're going to start our session with the facial. So from our well-dressed table from last week, I'm going to pull my facial towelette out. It's my organic one. We're going to be all super organic today, so I'm going to cleanse. Okay, now what we're going to do is we're going to take egg white, and I'm going to separate them. The easy way to separate them is I can do it the old-fashioned way or the new-fashioned way. Okay, it's just through your fingertips like that. I'm going to use them in my omelet tomorrow. Notice the different color of eggs, but that's because they're farmer's market eggs and they have different chickens. There we go. Now, if you want to, you can just whip this with a fork and uh, in your bowl. I am going to enjoy my vintage Vitamix of the era. So I'm gonna whip mine in my Vitamix, just so that I have egg white. Okay, watch out, it's gonna be loud. And now, 
If I really wanted to hurt your ears, I could have made literally meringue. <laughs> so here I go. I'm going to put the egg white on. Ooh, it's smooth. Okay. It's refreshing, Denise. I don't know what you're talking about. This is lovely. I'm going to get a little in my hair to see if it makes my hair curl a little bit more, just for fun. According to the Friends episode, I need to work on my T-zone. Okay, let's get a little on the neck and the chin. Okay, I'm ready. Woo! We're going to let it dry. See how it goes. So Denise said this is the quietest I've been in a long time because honestly the egg white I can barely move my face. Here's my warm water wash. It does feel wonderfully tight. I feel like I tightened my skin up immensely. Wow. Whoa, what a difference. Oh my gosh. Like now my forehead can't wrinkle. But my cheeks. <laughs> Am I rosy? Am I pink? Here comes the splash with cool. One more. Refreshing. Okay, so let's just check it out. I'll tell you what feels great. <laughs> what feels great is right here. Feels fantastic. This actually feels good. Really good. And I gotta say, I feel like I feel like my forehead is, is almost firmer. Crazy, but I have just a little tingle. Here we are in week six. This is Glamour Week. So we have 10 exercises this week. We have two repeats and three variations. So it should be an easy week for us to learn. The first week is all about posture. We're gonna put our hands behind our heads we're going to lace our fingers, we're going to stand like a model, and we're going to press our elbows back. Squeeze your shoulder blades back together. You want to feel a stretch in front. You're just going to hold it till you're tired. So Joseph calls this hip control. I call this lateral leg raises. It's for your hip. You're going to stand with a strong base leg. With the other leg, you're simply going to do a leg lift out to the side and then back down. I could use a little more stability over here. Out to the side and then back down. We're doing 20 per leg. We said it, Joseph's looking forward to bosom week. Here it comes. This is our chest exercise for this week. It's an overhead lift. So whatever you're using for weights, however you're managing to be flat. We're gonna start with our arms overhead, weight in each hand. We're gonna bring our arms up to the top, right above our chest and slowly come back down. Up to the top, arms over chest, slowly come back down. We're doing 15. Here's our first variation for this week. It's an ankle exercise. In the past we've been doing forward and back exercises. This is a sideways exercise. Give yourself some support with the leg that you're working on. You're actually going to turn your ankle out Pause, turn your ankle in, pause. Turn your ankle out, pause. Turn your ankle in, pause. 20 per leg. Okay, back to high school phys ed class, the good old windmill. Stand with feet wider than shoulder width apart, arms out to the side. We're gonna bend at the waist so the back is flat, and then we're going to turn to touch the toe, come back to center, turn to touch the toe, come back to center. We're going to do 20 per arm. We have to have an ab exercise. This is our variation on the scissor this week. So our scissor this week is lying down. Keep your legs just above the floor to a 45 degree angle and it's scissor, 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 scissor. 25 per leg. If you refuse to do an egg wash, this will help your neck. We're going to do a lateral bend. Basically, you're going to put your hand on your head 
and tilt your head away. When you are comfortable, you're going to push your head back against your hand lightly, and you're going to hold it until you feel tired. The key is that you are gentle but firm at the same time, so you feel resistance, but you don't feel pain. Until tired, both sides. Okay, we're going to do a little back arching today. This time we're going to work in back bend form. Arms are out in front, legs are together, toes pointed, elbows under shoulders. We're going to lift up in an arch and then come back down in a relaxed position. Lift up in an arch. At the top of your arch, squeeze your shoulder blades together. Think long, think tall. Lift your chin up and then come back down. We're doing 10. Okay, we have a second tummy tuck. This is a leg extension tummy tuck. So support yourself on your elbows. We're going to stretch our legs out so that they're just above the floor. And then we're going to tuck the knees into the chest. Stretch the legs out so they're just above the floor. Tuck the knees into the chest. 20 times. Are you ready for our first traveling exercise? So. From last time where we did a leg lift, we are now going to walk vigorously or march. So it's going to be march, 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 march. Joseph says around the room. Choose a big one. So there you have it. There was week number six already. Glamour. Yeah, after this week we're halfway through the program. It's just relearning portion sizes, really. A lot of it is, yeah. And being consistent with protein. Yeah, I never feel hungry, ever. I don't either. Yeah, it's weird because most diets I've ever done have always felt extremely hungry and I thought that's the only way that I would be able to lose weight is if I was really hungry all the time. But that's not true. The oh, milk. The milk helps. <laughs> I'm, I'm drinking the milk. Yeah. I'm drinking the milk. So stay tuned for next week. We have Patricia coming in to talk about the bosoms. That's right. Which will be really exciting. And I'm sure there's going to be some killer exercises in there or um, ridiculous advice that he gives, as, like he said with the egg white facial. Which was lovely, by the way. You actually liked it. I loved it. I'm going to do it again. Well, thank you guys for joining us. And um, please find us on Facebook. We are at Thruway Beauties. Uh, Kathleen's going to do some some of her killer cooking classes. We'll take this diet to school. It'll be very interactive. Well, thanks again for joining and comment below and let us know how you're doing. We'll see you next week. Have a sparkly week. <laughs> Bye. <laughs>